Hey guys. Um <laughs> really hard. I really didn't want to make this video, but uh I kinda of felt like it would it would help me to get things out in the open. Keep me accountable to what I'm about to do. Um I'm overweight, I'm fat, I'm morbidly obese is probably the medical term for it. Um, let's just have to get the truth out there, you know. Uh, get, or not get the truth out there like it was a secret. <laughs> but just to say out loud that I'm morbidly obese. I have been overweight for most, if not all, of my adult, adult life. Uh... Having been that way, you sort of, I guess, you get so much sort of stick for for being that way that you sort of, you build this shield up so everything, anybody, anything anybody says about your weight just goes over your head because you've heard it all before, you just don't want to hear it basically. Um... So that being said, why am I making this video? Um, it's, I'm making this video because I'm tired. I'm tired of being tired all the time. I'm tired of not being able to sleep properly because I'm overweight. I'm tired of having pains in my knees and my feet from carrying all this weight around. I'm tired of taking medication for high blood pressure because I'm overweight. I'm tired of not being able to go shopping on the high street to get clothes because I know they won't fit me. I'm tired of having no confidence to just go out in general because I feel like if when you're overweight folks folks stare at you and they say, Look at that mess sort of thing. Um scared to the point now I I haven't even been to like the cinema or anything like that in over f three years now just because I feel like I have to squeeze into the seats because I was so overweight and I just felt like embarrassed and hated, hated inconveniencing the people that I was with so always made excuses not to do it I hate being like that. And nothing was changing. Till. I mean it was spiralling out of control. Whereas like I said. I'm now on medication for high blood pressure. A very small medication. But it's medication nonetheless. Um, that at my age. I really shouldn't be taking. Uh, but to this. Again, it was spiraling out of control, and until recently, it was just I was just yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing for the rest of my life, taking medication, resigned to that fact. And it wasn't until a friend at work um, had suggested had suggested a film or a documentary that I should watch. Um, it was it was on the, the documentary was by the same guy that wrote this book. To produce me, Jason Vale. So the friend loaned me the the, uh, the documentary DVD to watch, and it has awoken something within inside inside me that says, you know what, this is something that is. I mean. <laughs> I'm not going to lose every weight overnight. It's there's that much to lose that it's going to take a while. But I feel as though this super juice me, which was a documentary about these eight people that went to Jason Vale's um, retreat and they lived off 
juice made from fruit and vegetables for 28 days and all they did was they drank this juice three or four times a day different juices and they, exercise, they, did, they did exercise and that's all they did for 28 days and the results were amazing now these people weren't fit uh, uh, athletes or anything these were people with the same condition even worse than what I have high blood pressure, ulcerative colitis um, sleep apnea, um, asthma, um, three or four of them were morbidly obese like me, um, and they all more or less had high blood pressure, which is my main thing now, is high blood pressure with the weight. Um, they all, by the end of the 28 days, they all made it to 28 days, and by the end, none of them had high blood pressure, and then all the morbidly obese people within 28 days had lost at least two and a half stone. All of them lost two and a half stone. Now, to me, I thought that's amazing. What Jason Vale was trying to, to get across was when it comes to medica medicating yourself healthy, it doesn't work. Now, he's not saying not have the medical profession there at all that's not what he was saying it's just saying medicine a lot of medicine is not working it's just curing the symptom rather than getting to the curing the cause you know the actual root problem of why you're feeling this way now a lot of the root problems of these chronic diseases like the high blood pressure the uh, colitis that there's different stuff um, was their diet, their lifestyle, their diets, and um, just by flushing the toxins out and giving them good live natural juice for twenty eight days, saved their lives. Um, I don't want to preach about the DVD. I think you should definitely, if you want to change your lifestyle and the way you eat. It's definitely something I think you should watch. It's called Super Juice Me, the documentary. It's called by Jason Vale, and it's fantastic. It's opened my eyes to, to a, a, something I can do myself. I can become in charge of my own health. So, with that being said, this channel, I. This has been my channel since 2007, so I've had this channel for nearly eight, well, what's it? Yeah, eight, I've had this for channel for eight years. And I enjoy making videos. I always have done. Um, I made my first video 2012. And the best videos I've had, or had best success with on this channel, is, um, hold on. The most successful videos I've had on this channel are um, review videos of fast McDonald's fast food. Um, I want to keep doing that, but I want to do it sporadically. And I want to start doing it from a place where you know I am allowed to have a McDonald's every now and again, once in a while. And it'll not be a big thing because my health is under control. Whereas every time I have a McDonald's now, for reviewing that, I just feel like crap afterwards because I shouldn't be eating it. So, for just now, the reviews won't be happening. Um, definitely until after New Year, until I get myself sorted out. So, immediately what is happening is I'm going to be doing this 28 juice diet. Excuse me. Um, starting tomorrow and I'm going to do a video every day for 28 days so <laughs> you're going to find out how much of a grump I really am um, this is something I need to do I need to get my health under control 
Um, I just hope the people that are subscribed to my channel, the very few of you that are, can understand there's something I need to do. Because if I'm not healthy, I can't do the videos. Simple as. I want to get rid of all this. So, I will be doing videos, but they're going to be different to the ones that you're used to. They're not going to be review videos. They will be about my my journey to better health. Um, it's going to be really hard. I would really value your support and sticking around and let me know how well I'm doing or how bad I'm doing or any suggestions. I mean, the next 28 days, I mean, I, ha I have... Jason, I bought the book, the 28 day thing, and it comes with... Um, comes with like a plan of what you can do and all the different juices you can re recipe. So, next 28 days, I know what I'm going to be doing. Um, like I say, I'm going to be doing a video every day, so I really hope that you guys stick around to watch them. Oh. <sighs>